I'm Susan Ireland, author of The Complete Idiot's Guide to the Perfect Resume. I'm going to read an email question to me and go ahead with my answer. This is from Deborah. My daughter recently stopped working for three months to recover from surgery. She now needs to find a new job. How does she acknowledge the employment gap and the fact that she is currently working temporary jobs while searching for a full-time position? Deborah, here's the good news. Because we're in the middle of the year, that is, it's July now, three months ago is still in the year of 2008. So if she puts down that she, her last job ended in 2008 without mentioning any months anywhere in her work history, the gap in employment will not be disclosed. As far as the employer looking at the, re, at the resume knows, that could have happened yesterday. It's true that on the job application and in the interview, she'll need to disclose this gap and perhaps the temporary work that she's been doing. But that's okay because by then she'll have her foot in the door for the interview and she can explain it and demonstrate that she's healthy and ready to go back to work. So don't mention this gap in employment at all. Don't mention the surgery and just let the things go and she'll find a new job without any problem as far as her resume goes. I'm Susan Ireland at SusanIreland.com